I remember getting uh, bad evaluations <laughs> for spirituality in the classroom um, and just feeling like I was struggling bringing it. It felt forced, it felt awkward, I just didn't feel like it was natural. And so I asked one of my colleagues, Larry Nelson, who I felt uh, was a master teacher, what he did. He uh, suggested that I share myself, uh, share some of my spiritual experiences, even when they didn't necessarily relate to classroom material, but if I'd felt prompted by the spirit, then to, to just go for it. I took his advice and tried that in my own classes, experimented with different things, and some things worked and some things didn't. I feel like even if something is hard at first and it doesn't feel natural, um, if you work at it, you can get there. I think that if you schedule it, it would feel forced, um, but I think you just are directed by the Spirit and share when appropriate. And literally, it's like maybe once or twice a semester this happens to me. It's like completely on the fly, like something cool happens in my life and I'm excited about it and want to share it. And it takes like a minute. So it's not a very typical thing, which I think students appreciate and then it feels, again, more genuine. My role as a mother is paramount in my life and that often comes up and it really um, sets the tone for the class in a very spiritual sense. When professors can make ourselves seem like real people, um, who struggle with things and who just want the best for our families and the best for our kids, again, it makes it more real. But just be willing to, to share a little bit of yourself. Um, just be open when the opportunity arises.